शिक्षा ज्ञान कक्षा और विज्ञान कभी सहमी उंगलियों से सवालों के जवाब ढूंढता कभी बातों बातों में सपनों और बचपन को फिर टटोलता साइंस टेक्नोलॉजी इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स स्टेम इन साइड ऑफ दीज हाई स्कूल क्लास रूम एंड वॉट दे स्पीक टू सम सम हु आर बॉयज एंड टू दर सम बिकॉज दे आर गर्ल्स एंड टू द डिफरेंसेज इन बिटवीन Nineteen eighty-one. We don't know what computer is. So here was our teacher. He took this calculator and he said, "What does a calculator do?" We said, "Two plus two, two into two, na 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 na." He said, "Think ten times more. Think think hundred times more." I'm like, you mean to say a computer can do all this? So our introduction to computer was starting from the calculator level, which we could not visualize that how far it can go. we are applying for a permanent position there is an upper age limit of 35 and that is not uh, relaxed for a woman actually so if you if there is such sort of hit like uh, if you are having a family and uh, uh, so if the maternity is considered there is no relaxation actually has applied to that so this is actually a tough period with the indian constitution stating it shall be the duty of every citizen of india to develop the scientific temper humanism and the spirit of inquiry and reform what amuses back in the classrooms are the canvases when boys and girls are asked to draw a scientist yeah. whatever a scientist looks like it can be any scientist so draw scientist study involves somebody walking into a classroom of high school students and telling them to draw a scientist and then you really look at what kind of scientists are coming out in these images and from these draw scientist study what we know is that uh, when children are younger so the younger the children are and the younger you administer this test to them there's a higher possibility of more women scientists being drawn but what happens is as people grow uh, into the sciences we see that the pictures become over time more and more eccentric male white tropes is this data which was very nice uh, because it had uh, uh, matched student teacher level information and we found that uh, if we analyze this matched teacher level data then teachers who exhibit greater level of gender bias uh, st- students taught by them uh, get affected so they get affected in a certain way uh, which is that girls uh, learning relative learning over time uh, is hampered as compared to boys and this is only uh, visible for math uh, not for english uh, so that's one one interesting result so then it's not really about the inadequacy or incompetency but the dialogues driving the childhood discovery as education aspires to be equal and experiential stories in their abundance of and about women in stem await to be seen heard and written stories that inspire like little jashri one thing that i learned while working on the plant is for her is that science is not a level playing field and that makes books like plant whisperer extremely important because they remind us a they produce these uh, you know stories that otherwise people don't engage with they need to balance uh, life narrative with the science narrative and I think the plant was for her tries to do it uh, in the way that it does. If we could, we would, right? What would we do different then in high schools as girls are introduced to STEM? Okay, our jo institution hai, wo basically six to twelve hai. So teenagers, ladke ladkiyan aate hain. Our jo Navodaya Vidyalay mein selection test hota hai. 
बेसिकली रीजनिंग बेस है तो बहुत सारे टेस्ट हैं जहाँ के हम पका करते हैं फिर स्पोर्ट्स होता है फिर हम खुले मंच से बाल विकास प्रतियोगिता कराते हैं इसमें एक एक करके So, if somebody really wants to learn math or teach math, what I do over here is I bring a lot of board games into the picture. We are think, thinking board games waste of time. No, board games is not waste of time. IIA and there are several research institutes like IIA, CRI, and all. They are opening their labs for uh, public on this National Science Day events. So people get a lot of chance to. See what is happening. You could see the excitement in the mm -hmm. students mm -hmm. when they actually come and visit these labs, mm -hmm. um, and then I am sure like they would be inspired uh, by those experiences. So we we'll, should have those experiences much more. One way is to really bring in stories of women scientists, and we have many, many, many stories of those. The first thing that is important is to recognize that there is a problem, right? I mean that there is uh, bias, there is stereotype. maybe in the form of uh, recognizing this uh, in the form of uh, you know mentioning these things in the uh, in the curriculum of the teacher training materials uh, and telling the teachers that see these things exist uh, you know so that they also acknowledge that among themselves uh, such such behavior uh, exists uh, and then one can think about different interventions or different policies which which could mitigate them now which policy would, would be more effective uh, that remains an open question Everybody like math? Yes. Okay. Till class after class seven, in class eight, how many people got scared with math? How many people got scared with math there? Acha, how many people did not get scared with math?